blue get on by vehicle and have a better chance of hiding their fucking kit in the back, doing whatever the fuck they Sim, eu não sei nem o que falar. É, lá tinha militares das forças especiais do mundo inteiro. Tinha da França, toda a Europa, toda a Europa tinha da, da Coreia do Sul, tinha do Chile, Estados Unidos, Canadá. Cara, o mundo inteiro estava lá, o mundo inteiro. Militares das forças especiais do mundo inteiro estavam lá. E simplesmente todo mundo, é, a informação que a gente tem, todo mundo morreu. Eles conseguiram acabar com tudo. É que vocês não estão entendendo o que é um caça soltar o míssil em cima da gente. Vocês não estão entendendo. Acabou, acabou. A legião foi, de, foi exterminada de uma vez, de uma vez só. Graças a Deus que eu saí antes. Graças a Deus. So for anyone who are wondering what is going on, alright? We were part of the Georgian National Legion, the 102nd Ukrainian Territorial Defense. Okay? Our base got fucked up. The base right next to us got fucked up. Americans, British, tons of British dead. All right? They're not saying nothing. They're counting our dead as their dead. They're trying to send us to Kiev with no fucking weapons, no kit, no fucking plates. The people who are lucky enough to get weapons are only getting magazines with like 10 fucking rounds, okay? When they wanted to send us to Kiev, we said no. Our whole group, a bunch of Americans, Canadians, British. So they told us we had to get the fuck out or they were going to shoot us in the back, all right? So me, this British guy, and another American, we fucking hid in the back of an ambulance to get out. We, we got to the border, and it, it was a whole nother mess. When you get to the border, anyone who has kit, anyone who has any military shit, they're fucking pulling you out of the line, and they're sending you back to the front. This human, we got dropped off about five clits from the fucking, uh from the border and we walked um, and we get to the border in this humanitarian group with a bunch of ex-SF veterans from England uh, pull us through signs saying you need to get like pulled us out and fucking like hit us and they were like you need to dump all your kit and they're pulling people out cutting up passports sending them back so we dumped our shit we got like in all of our fucking we got in like Red Cross vests and they had like fucking humanitarian passes to get us through the Ukrainian border. People need to stop coming here. It's a trap and they're not letting you fucking leave. The best way to leave is like in a Vic or a car or something. People who get on by vehicle have a better chance of hiding their fucking kit in the back, doing whatever the fuck they can, but do not try to leave Ukraine off foot if you're a volunteer. It's a mess, and it's it, it's a trap, and I have multiple people who can confirm this story for me. I'm getting 